What's going on everybody? You already know what day it is. It's Tutorial Thursdays. Um, so I've been getting a lot of requests and uh, these simple combinations we've been teaching, right? On where to put it in some tumbao. So, so I'm gonna link it like here somewhere, what video. Um, I'm talking about it's titled a very very simple combination and to show you guys what I'm talking about it's literally All right, you guys you guys could check that video out. So to basically show you where um, I would place that combination Let me play it for you first and then we'll break it down Really the best way I could tell you and the easiest way to trigger how to, uh, I would say, like jump in, you know, into the deep end of the pool is when you're doing your tumbaos, you should always count, you know, one, two, three, four. And after you finish that, you know, you land on the four, your one is gonna be that start of that combination. So you're basically gonna be one, two, three, four. You're basically one, two, three, four, do, do, ba, do, do, ba, do, do, one, two, three, four, do, do, ba, do, do, da, do, do. And the thing I like about um, doing it in a tumbao, you could always switch a note to make it easier for you. So rather, if, especially if you have like three drums, so rather than doing this, that last open slap, you could actually put it on your tumba. So what it would sound like is this. And you could always switch back and forth, so. Essentially, it's the exact same thing. Don't let your ears fool you. It's the exact same movement, except rather than an open slap here, you're gonna do an open tone on your tumba. So, let's listen to that in a tumba. Yeah, man, it's it's basically the same thing. It's the same thing I said, but adds a little bit more spice, you know, a little bit more flavor to that. But uh, it's it's a great tool. Uh, th this is why I think these combinations are great to practice, is because it really forces you to focus on landing on time. Like I need to land here. I need to make sure I fall on that one, or I fall on that four, or fall on that two. It's like so important especially as a percussionist to have great timing and these these combinations especially if you put them on a metronome man it's gonna take you places man it's gonna take you places so to recap basically when you're counting your tumbaos count one two three four And when you're about to do that one, start the combination. And obviously the combination starts on your tumba. Yeah, man, it's, 
it's, it's about counting, it's about counting. Yeah, so just make sure you always land on that one. This is not really a tutorial on how to do something. It's I just been getting a lot of requests on how to put in a tumbao. You know, it's good to hear and a good place to experiment. And if you put it on the metronome, you'll see, man, it's like obligado, obligado, ta, you know, it's, it keeps you there, man. It keeps you there. So yeah, so you guys could hear it kind of a little bit more. Sorry about that guys, but if you didn't notice, I was doing the exact same thing except putting the notes in a different place. So, ah, that's that's for another day. All right, y'all already know what to do. Like, subscribe. See you guys next week.